Dental malocclusions are classified. Based on the positioning of the upper and lower molars, class 3 is the rarest type of malocclusion. When upper molars line up behind the lowers and cause the lower jaw to protrude out, it's called a class 3 malocclusion or underbite. People who have class 3 malocclusions may have teeth positioned edge to edge or with a reverse overjet. This type of malocclusion can have consequences like difficulty chewing and prematurely worn teeth. Here we can see lower jaw and teeth overlapping the upper jaw and teeth. Class 3 malocclusions can be further categorized based on their origin. They can be dental or skeletal in origin. Dental class 3 malocclusion. The lower teeth are too far forward. Compared to the upper teeth skeletal class 3 malocclusion, the entire jaw is improperly positioned due to a growth problem. Here we can take a close look at the musculoskeletal level to see the movements of both lower and upper jaw and the position of the teeth. Let's view another case of underbite. Class 3 malocclusions will not correct themselves over time. It's important to act promptly to prevent the problem worsening, particularly if it appears at a young age. The right treatment is determined based on the origin of the malocclusion and the severity of the problem. Here are the treatment options. A palate expander to stimulate upper jaw growth. In children fixed braces for mild dental class 3 malocclusions in adolescents and adults. Orthognathic surgery W.